Hello friends, I am Anvesha and I welcome all of you to this channel Aspiring Banker Anvesha. If you are new to the channel, please subscribe to the channel and also click the bell icon to get notified for the upcoming videos. I make videos on English for bank exams. And every day on an academy, I conduct free live sessions at 9.30 a.m. and at 2.30 p.m. So at 9.30 a.m. I discuss questions for prelims examinations and at 2.30 p.m. I discuss questions for mains examinations. So make sure you attend both these sessions because these sessions will be very helpful to you. You will find the links to the sessions in the description box. Also, uh, if you use an academy for the first time, please use the invite code Annie for unlocking all the free content. An academy presents test series which are available for everyone for free of cost. This one is a reasoning test series with Sachin Modi sir. And this test series is conducted every Monday, Wednesday and Friday at 3 p.m. This test series is for quantitative aptitude and this one is conducted every Saturday at 8 p.m. This is a reasoning test series and this is conducted every Monday at 8 p.m. This is, a in, this is an English test series and this is conducted every Thursday at 8 p.m. This test series is a test series on current affairs and this is conducted from Monday to Friday at 9 a.m. The links of all these test series are given in the description box. Please go to the link and register yourself and avail this opportunity because these tests are available to everyone for free of cost. So please grab the opportunity. So today we are going to discuss some error detection questions on parallelism. Okay. Now, when do you need to apply parallelism? When different parts of a sentence are connected using any connector, okay? That connector can be and, or, not only, but also, nothing but, uh, and, uh, then comma, even comma is also a connector, okay? So, the then what do you need to do? You have to maintain the same structure in all the different parts that are connected using any connector okay now i face the trial believing in my own innocence and i desired the truth to prevail now here we have a connector that is and now this and is present for connecting this part with this part okay the first part with the second part so here you have i faced the trial believing in my own innocence believing is an ing verb believing in my own innocence and i desire to prevail the truth so here instead of i desire to prevail the truth what will come and desiring desiring the truth to prevail okay he likes to go fishing during the day but my brother prefers catching fish at night so here two parts are connected using the connector but okay so you need to maintain parallelism between the first and the second part now let's see what you have in the first part first part you have subject he then you have a verb likes singular verb likes and then you have infinitive that is 2 plus v1 okay and then you have ing this is in the first part. Now in the second part, what do you have? Brother subject, then singular verb, prefers, and then you have ing. Okay. So where is 2 plus v1? 2 plus v1 is missing. Okay. So you need to introduce this. So prefers to catch fish. Prefers to catch, to go. This is the verb. Okay. To go. So here you have to use to catch 2 plus v1 and this fishing fishing is what fishing here is a noun because this is a gerund so here do you have a noun present prefers to catch fish yes you have a noun present okay so here this part is incorrect part c is incorrect you have to use to catch instead of catching next a soldier obeys his senior willingly completely and with speed so here what are the connectors present comma and and these are the connectors so a soldier obeys his senior willingly 
adverb completely adverb and with speed this is incorrect you need an adverb over here and speedily okay next i like shopping and to eat out so here you have ing so here also you need ing and eating out next public transit such as buses or a train can help reduce air pollution so here the connector is or so you need to maintain parallelism between this and this because this or has been used for connecting these two okay so here you have plural buses so here also plural trains should come next he swiftly and with efficiency controlled the damaged car damaged car so here the connector is and in this part you have a verb swiftly of uh, sorry an adverb swiftly so here also you need an adverb so with efficiency is incorrect efficiently controlled the damaged car next we spent the whole day loitering here and there eating pizzas and we wiggled on the sofas so we spent the whole day loitering here and there loitering ing then you have a comma eating pizzas ing and then you have and so here the subject should be removed subject is already there you don't need to uh, you don't need to use the subject again and wiggled should be replaced with wiggling ing on the sofas next increased increased warming in the indian ocean and the resultant week of the indian summer monsoon may come in the way of india's goal of leading the world's wind power generation so in this sentence here you have and which is which has been used for connecting this part and this this part so increased warming so here what do you have here you have ing present ing so here also ing should come and the resultant weakening okay next my friends took me to a dancing show and then to a baby show dancing show this word is incorrect so here you have and present for connecting this one and this one okay so here instead of dancing show it should be dance show to a dance show and then to a baby show next i would rather pay for my fooding and lodging than assistance from my parents okay so here here rather than has been used for connecting what has been used rather than has been used okay so here after rather you have v1 pay and here after than you have a noun assistance which is incorrect so you need a v1 verb rather than take assistance so v1 should be introduced okay rather than take assistance from my parents next the school campus has space for a new playground but not computer lab so here what do you have here but has been used for connecting this part and this part so but not for a computer lab it is not it is time not for words but for actions okay next my income is less than my wife so here my income has been compared with my wife's income so here apostrophe should be used than my wife's why because here you see uh, my income so possession is there so in the second part also you need to use a possession so here these two parts are connected using than okay next not only are digital cameras changing our photography but also altering our privacy norms so here not only and but also has been used for connecting not only but also okay so not only but also so here after but also what do you have you have ing verb but here after not only what do you have you have a be verb and then a noun so the position of not only has to be changed so digital cameras you have to start from here digital cameras are digital cameras then are not only changing our photography 
so digital cameras are not only changing our photography so just place are not only changing our photography then after not only what do you have you have a ing verb and here also you have a ing verb okay so uh, i will end the session here i hope i could make this parallelism topic somewhat clear uh, in front of you so there is one more thing in parallelism that is if there are adjectives present if there are adjectives present then you have to keep all the adjectives in the same degree that is if i say rithik roshan rithik roshan is a handsome and the best actor then this sentence is wrong because here and has been used for joining this part and this part okay so here this handsome this is a positive degree of adjective and best this is uh, this is a superlative degree of adjective so here you need to make the uh, both the adjectives in the same you need to keep both the adjectives in the same degree so rithik roshan is the most handsome and the best actor okay is the most handsome and the best actor right thank you so much i'll see you again in my next video bye